Here's the thing. Sometimes strength has to come from yourself. Because if it doesn't come from yourself, who is going to come from? Who in your family, who in your clique, who in your friends group is going to bring the strength to the table? Sometimes it's on you. You are the glue to this shit. You are what the world needs, bro. A lot of you are what the world needs, so you have to show up for you. In these times of bad posture, in these times of weakness, I just got back. I see people walking around. Shit don't look right. <laughs> Shit don't look right, bro. Just to see the way some people are right now. Some, some things look all right. Some things look on point. There's people with families walking around, but bro, some shit just ain't right right now. And you are the one that has to have the strength during these times, because like I said, who else is? Sometimes that's what you're put on earth to do. Some lions, some male lions, that's what they're put on earth to do. They are the leaders, they are dominant. They are the forefront of the crew of the army. You are the one, brother, that walks in the house of darkness and lights it right up. Before you get to the house, everyone's waiting on you. Everyone's waiting on you to walk in the door. And oh my God, he's here, he's home. We feel happy now because you're the forefront of this shit, bro. You bring the strength, you bring the good time, you put shit together like glue. So don't overthink these times. Have strength during these times. It's just another day. It's just another day. Bro, we are, <laughs> we are in times right now. Some people hate it, bro. Some people's energy is not right. And you know why? You're overthinking. If your energy is not right during these times, it's from one cause. It's all in your head, bro. What's the difference between right now and last week? What's the difference of right now and, and two weeks to a month later? There's no difference. It's all in your head. Instead of overthinking during these times, walk with strength. Go for a walk, get something done, go to the gym. There's no time to just, oh, everyone else and their families and then here I am and all this shit, like, bro, you're the one that gotta bring the strength. You're the one that gotta show up and be strong. Some of you don't have anything. Some of you don't have a family. Some of you don't have nothing. Now you really got to be strong. Now you really got to show up. I'll tell you what, I'm going to show up tomorrow at my folks' place and I'm going to be the glue to what's missing. Without me, miserable days for them. I guarantee it. It wouldn't feel right. It wouldn't be right. They're going to be overthinking. They're not going to be in the right headspace. I show up. He's here. And all this. Because you're the one, bro. You're the one. Some of us was put on earth to be the strength. Some of us was put on earth to be chosen. Some of us was put on earth to be the glue that's missing, to get things together. And guess what else? There's some chicks right now out there in this world. Let's say in multiples of multiples that at one point during this year wanted to play hard to get wanted to play let's just ignore him and wait till he chases me because I just think I'm this and now she's thinking about you every single day not a day not a moment goes by that she's not thinking about you right now wishing 
she had your energy and presence right now to make to light her up because she can't do it herself. And that's what happens. You want to play games? You want to be you you want to act unloyal, unfaithful, like you're just you're just uh, everything the cat's meow. During these times, they're thinking about you every second because you're the glue to this shit. But they were feeling just so all right during summer. Oh, 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 feeling myself in a good mood and everything else. Right now, not so much. Why? Because you're the glue to this shit, bro. It's funny. It's funny. People in their times of desperation and neediness, oh my God, they just want you so much now. They just want to talk to you so much now. They're so sad and down and depressed not with, without you. Because you're the glue. And folks, <laughs> I'm going to tell you something. Things have gotten so bad in this world today and people ain't right because everyone takes everything for granted. And guess what? I ain't that stupid. I ain't that stupid to take everything for granted. I don't take the things I cherish in my life for granted at all. Not at all. But most people in modern society do because they have access to just whatever they want. They just feel they can talk to you or not talk to you whenever. It's at their convenience, right? And whenever you put a stop to this, oh, it hits all. You put a stop to this right now during these times, oh, you're going to see true colors. They're not doing so well. They're not doing so hot. They're very shallow. They're very low in energy. They're very <laughs> just waiting for you because you're the glue. A lot gets exposed, bro. A lot gets exposed. These are very selfish, narcissistic people to a whole other level. You can be selfish in a good way. You can be selfish in a terrible way. That is a terrible way. If you're a man, you have to be selfish with your time to put food on the table. That's what you have to be selfish for so you can actually protect, provide, and do what you're supposed to do as a male, as a leader, as a guy that's at the forefront of this fucking crew. That's what you gotta do. That is a good selfish. But as for them, <laughs> terrible. And it's because they're greedy. They're greedy and they take things for granted. These are people we just cut off and don't look back. But they're always just paying attention to you. They're always waiting to see if you're gonna come and contact them. And you're not gonna, and they're gonna get even more shallow and more shallow and more shallow. More depressed, more depressed, more depressed. Why? Because you ain't getting there. And you sit here in your strength, you're the, you're, you're the glue to this shit. And they're awfully shallow without you. They need you. And here you are. You know what you're going to do? You're going to spend time in these times with people that actually can matter to you. That's what you're going to do. You're going to spend time with people who was always there. You're going to spend time with people who deserve your presence. Not these flakes that are greedy, that take everything for granted. Until all of a sudden it all comes crashing back down on them and they can't, they don't have a pot to piss in. They don't have a person to talk to. They don't have nothing. And it's all because they're greedy. They don't deserve you. They don't deserve you to be their glue. They don't. But you can be the glue for somebody else, people that deserve it. You can show up somewhere else around people that deserve your presence and you can be the glue there. Because guess what? That's what it is for us. That's what it is for us. 
And it's not that people don't bring us any value either. But you are most definitely the glue. You're definitely the piece that's missing. Like severely missing. Because they could be together and it's not enough. You show up and that's the glue. That's what I'm talking about. It puts you together. It makes things make sense. But without you, mm -mm 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 -mm. why? Because they don't make them like you every day. That's why. You're just elite at energy, at knowing how to have good energy, knowing how to take care of yourself. You know how to survive, right? You know what it's like to be taken for granted, thrown to the side, left without a pot to piss in yourself. And guess what? You did it all by yourself. You came back from the dead yourself. You're renewed because you have strength. Without, that, without strength, you couldn't do that in the first place. You've been that person, and now you're this person because you have internal strength like none other. You can go through anything and come back. A positive, highly energetic person that can put anything together if he or she wants to. But we ain't going to spend time and we ain't going to be around people who do not appreciate us, who want to take advantage of us who want to come to us just for their little needs and then go off as if we don't even matter, they can get the hell out of here. I don't give a damn about you. And I can just sit here and lie, unlike you, because you lie all the time. People like that. In other words, <laughs> they need you, you don't need them. And it's funny when things are going well for them for a few months of the year that it is. Maybe during summer. They don't want to be, be bothered right now. They just want to do what they're doing. And, uh, they're all high in their shit, right? Feeling good. The energies go to its side. They feel all, all awesome. The second things start to come caving down on them. The second these times roll around. Now they need you. But that's the only time they come is when they need you. And when you cut that off, wah, 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 wah. You know why? Because they don't have internal strength the way you have internal strength. It don't matter who's around, who's not around for you. You have, it, you have internal strength. And it's what a lot of others don't have. <laughs> Bro, like I said, I've been around the block today. I've been to a few stores. I've been to the gym. I've been to a few places. And I saw people today. I'm telling you, bro, it's during these times. People ain't doing so hot. Some people deserve it. Some people don't. Some people, some of you are in bad positions. You are the one that has to have the strength. I was in bad positions before. I was the one that had to have the strength, and guess what? I had the internal strength. I looked at myself in the mirror as an older teenager and said, I'm gonna do whatever it takes. I don't care. I don't care how I feel. I don't care. I'm going to get this shit done and I'm going to live on. And you just keep living that way. You just keep living that way. Every single day. You don't overthink, oh my God. <laughs> it's not going to happen for me. Oh my God. No, 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 no. You're here right now in the moment. Doing something all the time. It's to the next thing, it's to the next thing, it's to the next, to the next, to the next, to the next. You don't allow your mind to wander and oh, oh my God, it's not going to happen. I'm putting in all this work and it's not going to happen. No. Because you're not going to stop. You're focused on what you're doing all the time and you're just not gonna stop. You're like a man possessed. You ain't gonna stop. Nothing's gonna stop you. Nothing's gonna all, like allow you to crumble and have low energy and just like give up. Nothing. You're gonna fight. If you can't afford a gym membership, which I was never in that position, but some people are in that position. You can't afford a gym membership. 
You gotta do laps around your damn house. You, you gotta do something. You gotta exercise outside, outdoors. That's what we had to do when COVID hit. When I was living at my spot that I'm not at right now, there's a park, a four minute walk from my place. There's bars everywhere. I'm doing getting pull ups, bro. I'm doing like dips on this little, these little two little bars. Like I'm going crazy. Doing ab workouts by holding the bar and like lifting my, like doing the, the lag raises. I did whatever it took. Whatever it took, you gotta adjust. Bad things are gonna happen, bro. Bad times are gonna come. These times are gonna come. And it's gonna be you that makes the wise decisions. Don't overthink things, take action. The second you catch yourself in moments of weakness where these negative thoughts come in, like I instantly take action, instantly. Like what else are you gonna do? Some people, like, bro, I said this before and I'll say it again. Life comes down to decision making. And those who make wise decisions, because yes, we all have choices. Every one of us. Some people make terrible choices, terrible decisions out of weakness. Some people are in hard times and they make tough decisions and it's going to build them. They do the hard thing. The next day, they do the hard thing. The next day, they do the hard thing, and it just it builds them. You build yourself. Physically, externally, internally, you build yourself. And that's what it takes. We were put on earth to be strong, to have strength. We're not bulletproof. But on earth, some of us are the closest to it. Anytime anything anything happens that oh shit ain't right, you get to work. You do what you're supposed to do. You don't wallow in the times, you go through the times. You're here, you're present during the times. You don't make weak decisions during the times. You make hard decisions, you make wise decisions. Is it wise to sit around overthinking? about, oh my God, I should have this in my life right now and that in my life right now, and oh my God, no, it's, it's just not. It's not wise. And that is your choice to stick around being so slow, so still, to allow all that to come in, that is on you. You can choose to get up and be faster, more active. I just got back from the gym. I'm now sipping on an electrolyte drink. I got more shit to do after this. And then tomorrow, a little bit of celebration, nothing crazy. And then we're back to it the next day. And we are the glue to that shit, bro. We're the glue to the celebration. We're the backbone of the family. We're the backbone. We're the strong friend. We're the guy that the women come to for strength. For strength. So, if you're in the times where things ain't so well, choose wisely. Choose to be strong. I don't want any emails from anybody telling me I'm giving up, man. Don't, don't even email me. Get on your shit. That's what you can do. You can choose to be strong. Don't even do that. You're overthinking already by emailing me about some dumb shit like that. Choose to be strong. You have a choice. You have a damn choice. You got some water, you got some food. Get the water in you, get some food in you. Allow it to energize you and start to move around and start to do some push-ups, get to the gym, do whatever you gotta do. Choose that, because it's a wise decision. Every single day, every 24 hour period you have in front of you, we have choices, we have decisions. Every single day. 
And that's what it's going to come down to. Your ability to make good decisions day after 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 weeks, months, and years. It comes down to did you make good decisions or bad decisions? Because you can lie to yourself. You can lie to anybody else. But the results are going to show. So you might as well make the right decisions because if you're not, it might not be good. It might not be good. You are the one people is waiting on. You're the one that got to be strong. You're the one that got to put shit together like glue. You got to be the glue to put the shit together. Don't wish that it was different. Don't because some people's dependent on you, bro. Some people are dependent on you that actually matter. So you got to show up for them. Because I'm sure they have showed up for you before. Whenever you couldn't for yourself. Maybe when you were like a baby. You got to return the favor. Because guess what? Father time catches everybody. With father time, as life goes on, things change. It's your turn. It's your turn to give back. It's your turn to be strong. Let's go.